Hello everyone, Golden Hawk here, creator of Ancient Powers and the House of Life. I'm here in Boise getting ready to go to the One Soul Expo. Yesterday was absolutely crazy. Um, so many people uh, coming in from all over and some really great masters. Uh, I wanted to address today a piece that uh, I did uh, speak about that has to do with ancient powers. Hello, Robert. Um, and it has to do with hole that we have within ourselves that just we can't just we just can't fill with anything. And no matter how much we love, and no matter how many people come around us that say they love us it's very difficult to come into resonance and to feel our love feel that our love is accepted by others and or to feel that they really love us and we're going why why do you love me and why do I love this that whatever and sometimes we question even that and uh, the reason for this is because of our disconnect from the free quantum field as quantum creators and our connection with the creator the Sun we can see the Sun we can feel the heat of the Sun but we do not feel or most people do not feel that living connection and this is the actual father connection rather than hi Jesse rather than the than the father outside of us or an abusive father God this is the streaming actual energy that fills that hole and nothing else will do so many of the sons of the sons and the daughters of the sons, so many that are, you know, bards, so many that would be, uh, well, sorcerers, shamans, teachers, leaders for this next age that we're moving into, have a very huge awareness of this whole. And, um, a lot of them are, a lot of you even possibly, have struggled with um, trying to fill that hole and ending up falling in with drugs, alcohol, uh, going from partner to partner, that type of thing. Uh, the actual ability to fully connect with this streaming life source is what is necessary. Um, I've spoken before of the seals, and this is basically what I addressed yesterday in a much longer version. Um, but the idea that we have had for thousands of years, uh, different cultures, different groups, that was actually implanted into us that you're the chosen people of Yahweh, you're the chosen people of Allah, you're the chosen people of Jesus, and he died for you and he's still bleeding for you even though he, you know, resurrected. And, um, and as I stated before, it's not about being the chosen people. It's about being the people who choose. And choosing the Father represent, representation, who and what is the father energy and that life-giving source that absolutely unconditional love that will not leave you dark or day it's the Sun the Sun is reflected by the mother moon or a little differently in in that Kemetan or Egypt, but the sun never leaves you. The sun 
make sure all things are provided through life on this earth and needs to be truly indwelling. The solar plexus within the body, which fires the heart, which holds the heart open, which gives us, hello Arturo, um, which gives us that filling energy is disconnected from the dimensional energy of the sun. And that is what it will take to fill the hole. There are several healings um, in ancient powers to do soul pieces, past life pieces, family pieces, relationship pieces um, for people to work with. The main piece is to remove the seal and reconnect to feel the filling from earth to sun this energy which is becoming the phoenix just becoming pharaoh that column between heaven and earth and i have had a great day yesterday I'm on my way today, and I didn't know if I'd have any time to even talk to you people, but it felt very important to uh, let you know, everyone out there know what's so awesome. We've got, uh, I'll have some pictures, and we're going to have some connections with uh, one of the gentlemen here that does uh, Hidden History, uh, pretty well known out there for it, and several other connections, and of all things, What's been in my heart, number one, so I've been, the one thing that's been wearing on my mind, where am I going to find another person who can do what I'm doing? Why haven't I met someone else? I did. Chi Zhang, yay, because I need to train somebody. And she's genius and fabulous and beautiful and I don't know if she's joined the group yet. She has, uh, we're friended on, the pa on my page, and I'm so excited because this has been part of my lifelong journey is to find someone else who can do this. I've never withheld anything from any of my students, from any anyone who's, uh, who's joined. And anyone who joins Ancient Powers and actually becomes part of the structure becomes a student and then to a certain level becomes a teacher. That's the idea. Just by living in your wholeness, by creating home around you, you become a teacher. That's the most important thing you can do is to create home, to be whole, but to find someone else that can actually do the activations that I can, that I can pass them to. But here are the seals. This is the energy for it because it's all in frequency and uh, they have to be able to hear it, they have to be able to see it. Um, hello Russell and, uh, and I've looked for so long and I found number one and I've got like this big five-year thing because I know I'm going to be doing this myself for another five years at least and I want 5,000 people to come in and to actually come in, do the full walk actually do the empowerments, release the seals when they're ready, as each person is ready. And I want to find enough other activators that it's going to be easy when people reach this level during these shifts to find us. They've hidden us for a long time. We were chased, we were burned in Europe, we were killed here, and uh, I want to get these ancient ancient civilization pieces, the ancient tribal pieces, 
back to the people. And I love you all. And hopefully I'll be able to do a couple real quick lives, you know, like four or five minutes here or there today um, with the connection at, at the expo and uh, introduce a couple people that have been fascinating. And, uh, and if I call, I will see you shortly. And excuse all this, I am having an allergy to my sunscreen. And so this is me with lipstick and no makeup. I love you. And uh, later in the day, hopefully, under this blazing 103-degree sun. Nefrakah.